there are a lot of heroes emerging from that day. First responders who arrived on the scene within about four minutes of learning about the shooting. And one of the first men there, Police Lieutenant Mike Madden, and he is speaking out about what he saw. We wanted to get in there and we wanted to stop any further innocent people from being, being injured and possibly killed. As we entered uh, into the conference room, uh, the, the situation was surreal. Uh, it was something that I don't think, again, we prepare for and they try to, an active shooter, we talk about sensory overload, they just try to throw everything at you to prepare you for dealing with that. Uh, what, you're, what you're seeing, what you're hearing, what you're smelling, um, and it was all of that and more. Um, it was unspeakable, uh, the carnage that we were seeing, the number of people who were injured and unfortunately already dead. And when we entered, there was fresh gunpowder and the smell of gunpowder in the air and the pure panic on the face of those individuals that were still in need and needing to be safe. And then we went further into the building and that was a difficult uh, choice to have to make as well, passing people that we knew were, were injured and needed of the assistance. But our goal at that time had to be trying to locate the, the shooters and, and deal with them. You know, those first responders did everything right. What's so scary is that the couple knew how quickly they had to get out of that facility. Yeah, and how they led the way and led people out and said, I'll take a bullet for mm -hmm. you, but let us lead you. It was really remarkable. It was.